Hi, I'm Lauren Graham. I'm thrilled to be here in Puerto Rico. Um, I've never been here before. I'm going to meet some families and meet some kids and uh, find out a little more about how and why your donations matter so much. Eight months ago, Hurricane Maria hit. Category 5 Hurricane Maria now closing in on Puerto Rico. Today, there is still so much devastation and need here. 13-year-old Gabriela was at home when the storm came. When everything was happening, what did your family do? Video the family took shows the hurricane battering their house. All seven of them had to hide in one tiny closet and pray for their lives. How old are your cousins? Eran dos bebés, pero la mayor tenía tres años y la menor tenía siete meses. Seven months. And who took care of the baby? Pues yo lo que hice fue correr con ella por todo el pasillo hasta que llegamos al closet y allí la puse. Y... Pero pensé que no iba a pasar algo muy fuerte. She gave me a tour of her home where they still live. It is still devastated. It looks shaky. <laughs> yeah. It's dangerous and barely livable. This is the kitchen. And does anything work? No. You can hear the wind rush right through. That's not even a fraction of what it must have sounded like, right? There's reason to be nervous. A new hurricane season is about to begin. Gabriela steadies herself by thinking of the future. What do you dream of becoming? It's just they deserve better. They deserve better. It's every kid I talk to um, has a dream. Red Nose Day dollars can help children like Gabriella with hot meals, education, and crucial emotional support. No one here is asking for help but I wanted to come here to be the person to ask for help. Please give what you can. It is needed, it is appreciated, it is important. It's our responsibility. These people deserve more. <laughs>